spot diagnosis. This is facial eczema, which is one of the most common things we see in dermatology. This commonly presents in very young children and typically presents as red, scaling, itchy rash with ill-defined borders. Next up is rosacea. Now, rosacea comes in various forms, but the most common type would be marked erythema associated with multiple papules and pustules. Rosacea typically affects the central face and spares the skin around the eyes and lips. Unlike rosacea, this is acne vulgaris, also known as pimples or spots to a lot of people. People with acne tend to have greasy skin, also known as zebria, and you get multiple papules, pustules, associated with comedomes, which are the white heads and black heads. Now, you don't get comedomes in rosacea, and this is how you differentiate between the two conditions. People often mistake this for acne, but this is actually perioral dermatitis, secondary to topical steroid use. It presents as erythema, papules and pustules around the mouth with no comedomes and people tend to complain of pain rather than itch. There is often a history of topical steroid use. Let's make some 